Hey y'all, welcome back to Yellow Texas. Up next, we are headed to a place with a whole lot of history, some fantastic fans, and one of the best players in all of baseball. So come along as we make our way to Arlington to check out Globe Life Park, home of the Texas Rangers. Today we are here at Globe Life Park, home of the one and only Texas Rangers. And today we are giving fans an inside look of the team, the stadium, and what the future holds for this amazing franchise. So why don't you say we go ahead and check it out. Opening over two decades ago, this retro open-air ballpark seats more than 48,000 fans and features an asymmetrical playing field, home run porch, and some pretty impressive Texas architecture. But as the saying goes, all good things must come to an end because by 2020, the Rangers will be in a brand new state-of-the-art stadium just right down the street. But until then, all these dedicated fans are just soaking up all the great things this place has to offer. Chuck Morgan, the voice of the Texas Rangers. You've been here for 35 years. You know this place better than anyone else. What is the atmosphere like when we walk into Globe Life Park? The first thing I think that hits you is the, the majesty of the outside of the ballpark. And, and uh, it's just a beautiful place. And But when you get inside and, and we've got uh, 35, 40,000 fans cheering for the Rangers, uh, it, it's pretty special. What's kind of like the highlights that people need to go to and see whenever they walk through these doors? The first thing would be to look at the inside of the park and, and look how uh, some of the things that, like the home run porch and right field. And then I think they need to sample the food, uh, great food here at the ballpark. Can't uh, can't go to the ball game without a good hot dog and peanuts, <laughs> yeah. but uh, and then you know just watching the players themselves and then some of the things that we do uh, during the game. I've heard some great things about the food, especially those hot dogs you've been talking about. Can't wait to get my hands on one of those. I think you need to go get the two foot long boomstick. Speaking of hot dogs, this place had one of the biggest I've ever seen. This is not your ordinary hot dog. It is a boomstick, which means two feet of yumminess right here in between some bread buns. I'm gonna check it out. What I loaded it with a uh, chili cheese, chili cheese and uh, jalapeno. This frankfurter measures in at a whopping two feet long, so massive it could feed you, your family, and maybe a few of your friends. And luckily for me, being a TV host, has its perks, so I was able to do a little Q&A with some of our favorite Rangers. We're gonna go with the serious questions right here. What was the last thing that you Googled? Last thing I Googled, I think um, checking up on baby stuff. Okay, so we are in Texas. What a burger or In-N-Out? Ooh, In-N-Out. Uh, In-N-Out. In-N-Out. Why? I, I love the In-N-Out food. But you're in Texas. Yeah, I know, but I, I still love the In-N-Out food. And as much fun as it was talking to the Rangers, it was even more exciting to see them play. I gotta say, it was an awesome day of meeting incredible fans and getting to know what the team is all about. And you better bet I'm coming back for those hot dogs. See you out there. Want to experience Globe Life Park for yourself? Well, visit the link below to learn more. All right, that is all the time we have here today on Yellow Texas. Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And remember, it's a great state, so get out and explore it. You know what they say, you only live once, Texas. We'll see you all next week.